world normals, tangent normals, vertex normals, point normals, split normals, soft edges, hard edges, projection, baking, normal maps. What is all this? And why should we care? Well, have you ever had normal map baking artifacts like surface warping or ray intersection errors? In this series, we dive into these concepts and learn the part normals play in our 3D art. By the end of this course, you'll have a deep understanding of normals and be able to debug and solve almost any normal map baking scenario. In chapter one, normals, what are they? We learn about normals and the role they play in surface construction. In chapter two, what do they do? We dive into how normals can be manipulated to alter the look of a surface. In chapter three, projection, we explore how normals are used to represent complex geometry on a flat surface. In chapter four, texture baking basics, we finally take a look at baking our high polygon model to a texture. We apply what we've learned thus far to debug and solve almost any projection issue. Moving on to chapter five, what are tangent space normals? We build our own tangent space normals and learn how they work to better understand why they're used. In chapter six, why your normal map bakes are warped, we take a look at why low polygon normals play a huge part in how high polygon detail is projected onto a surface. In chapter seven, baking with support edges, we take everything we've learnt and bake a clean normal map using support edges. This model we use is a little tricky and has quite a few gotchas for us to solve. In chapter eight, baking using normal map blending, we take a different approach and blend two normal map projection methods to create a clean map. Finally, in chapters nine and 10, we replicate the normal map blending technique in both Maya and Blender. This illustrates these methodologies are program agnostic. I hope you enjoy this course and find it useful. Until next time, take care.